Why are you all so happy today? Mandela, who's Mr. Mandela? Teachers and pupils of East Bank and King David High Schools. It is a particular pleasure to be with you in the week of National Youth Day. When we commemorate Youth Day, we remember the past and we also look to the future. It is a tribute to all those young people who lost their lives, or their families, or sacrificed careers so that the people of South Africa should one day taste freedom. And it is also a pledge to all those who missed opportunities because they were denied even the most basic of resources, like education. But you are different because you have the most wonderful opportunities that your parents could only dream of. Every opportunity is open to you, whether you are a boy or a girl. Remember that one of the highest offices in this country, the Speaker of Parliament, is a lady. But you can't make use of those opportunities if you do not listen to your teachers, if you are not disciplined if you do not do your homework. Only those people, only those children who are able to listen carefully in the classroom, to be disciplined, and to do your homework, will be able to serve society. When I look at you, I see my grandchildren. And therefore, it is my hope and ambition that each and every one of you should live up to our expectations, the expectations of your parents, the expectations of your country, and the expectations of uh, Africa and the rest of the world. And therefore, one of my messages to you, again, is that I uh, listen carefully to your teachers and uh, do your work in the class. But what is more important, you must do your homework very carefully. And if you do that, you will find it easy for you. The new South Africa is just over three years old. Like all growing things, it needs love and discipline so that it grows up healthy, has good values, is self-reliant, and can play its part in meeting the challenges of the family of nations. This will require the efforts of all citizens not just the government. It means that everybody should contribute in their own way to making South Africa the country of our dream. Thank you.